Advanced polls are open and the provincial election now nine days away. Many British Columbians are still left with questions about the province's political landscape. On Thursday night, three political scientists from UBC were part of a public discussion to shine some more light on some key political issues. So this election matters and so take some time to find out what the, the policy differences are between the, the leading parties and if you don't like their answers to take a look at the Green Party but uh, take that time and then go out and get it voting. Some of the key issues discussed included housing, health care, public safety and the toxic drug crisis. Political scientist Stuart Prest has this advice for voters. I think it's uh, worth thinking about what really matters to you. What, what are the things that you are concerned about? Governments affect our lives in so many ways. And so if you are really concerned about access to housing, spending some time to look at what are the two parties that are, are uh, uh, potentially forming government saying about what they're going to do for, for housing. Political science professor and expert on climate change, Catherine Harrison, says environmental issues are not getting as much attention in this election and breaks down what voters can expect from a B.C. NDP or a B.C. Conservative government. The NDP policies, we're not on track to meet our 2030 target, but those policies can bend the curve and get us closer, whereas I would expect emissions to grow um, in the absence of those policies with um, more gas development, LNG, and also population growth under a conservative uh, government. The final day of voting in the provincial election is October the 19th. In Vancouver, Joe Sadowski, City News.